during Red Flag, one of our primary roles over here was to complete some airfield survey. So that was uh, going out into the field, identifying suitable uh, airfields, then surveying them and making sure that they were safe for aircraft to land in. So we're going to measure the length, the width, uh, and make sure that it's long enough, and also make sure there's no obstructions that are going to uh, get in the way of the aircraft when it's landing. We also need to confirm the soil strength to make sure that the aircraft is not going to damage itself or the airfield. Primarily we've been uh, inserting via parachute and, and it has provided some uh, challenging conditions mainly due to the weather. It's been uh, pretty cold in uh, Vegas at the moment so when the team has been exiting the aircraft it's approximately minus 20 degrees. Also, given the high terrain that's around here, the landing zones are quite challenging, uh, with some of them being up around 5,000 foot above ground level. A firm is 300 feet plus from uh, the N2 markers to the water's edge. We're keeping a close eye on it as well. Uh, this has provided a great opportunity for Four Squadron because it's an environment that we don't get to train in very often. Firstly, the weather is, uh, is a lot colder and the altitude a lot higher than what we typically see in Australia. And also in these large coalition environments, we get access to aircraft and coalition members that we don't normally have the ability to train with. 